face it. See, all I want you to do is be my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away my love. But just knowing like, okay, the woman I want to be, she looks like this. She has this. She talks like this. She walks like that. Having that stuff, like having a vision. That's a vision for what you see yourself as. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another weekly vlog. My name is Mahogany. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn on that post notification bell so you're notified every time I drop another video. If you're returning, hey, boo, how you doing? Y'all, today is a new day. Today is actually December the 19th. Yeah, today's December the 19th. Just got out of the shower, got dressed, did my skincare and everything like that. And my makeup artist is downstairs, so I'm getting ready to jot downstairs super 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 fast and sit in the chair so i can get my makeup done i feel like i'm out of breath y'all because i have been ripping it running today already um filming and stuff this morning but i'm um, getting ready to get my makeup done now because i have like some campaigns i need to shoot some content i need to do i'm gonna be showing y'all my look it's gonna be so cute let's go on and get into it right now it's about 9 45 i usually have like 4 a.m call times but today Oh, thank the Lord. I was able to sleep in a bit and we're doing a 945 call time. My makeup artist. So being ready to head down. I pulled my clothes from out of my closet that I'm going to be wearing for my campaign shoot today. So literally all I need to do is get my makeup done, tweak my hair, and then we're going to start shooting. So I'm going to be taking you guys with me. I thought it would be a perfect time to start up another weekly vlog. So welcome into my week. Today is Monday, as I said, December the 19th. So let's get into it. <laughs> all right guys so makeup's done um i'm gonna show you guys what i'm gonna be wearing i'm gonna be shooting some content here in a few um so i want to show you guys one of my looks it's gonna be so cute Mm, mm, mm. all right y'all so this is what i'm wearing i'm wearing like this corset right here i think this is so freaking cute and then i'm pairing it with these pink leather pants then i'm going to throw in these shoes right here i know it's different but i think it's going to be so so cute and then i'm going to i think do my silver bag right here with some silver so here it go. I'll go right there, y'all. Um, some silver like shades and stuff. So here's the look. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I'm going to literally shoot some content now for my Instagram. If you aren't following me on Instagram, I don't know what you're doing, but on today's agenda, um, I have to shoot some content for Instagram, some for TikTok, because I am on TikTok, y'all. Make sure you subscribe to my TikTok. Then I have some Christmas content to shoot. So today is really like a heavy content day. I'm not going to be doing much in the office today. Mainly just um, shooting content and kind of prepping for this week since today is Monday. So let's get into shooting. We're going to do some single stuff. We're going to do some couple stuff. Just got a lot to do. So um, let's do it. Good morning, guys. Welcome back. It's another day. Getting everything set up in my glam room. Why do my eyes look like this, y'all? Like, I did have makeup on, mascara on yesterday. Ooh, that's so bright. I don't like it too bright in the morning, y'all. But I did have mascara on yesterday, but Jesus, it's like it didn't want to come off. Comment down below, like, some ways y'all can, um, some ways that I can, like, get rid of, like, stubborn eyeliner because yeah the eyeliner is definitely stubborn so just combing out my hair this morning i have showered and did my skincare this morning showered threw on like a big tee and some sweats for work this morning 
Um, I think I have some videos to shoot. So for the Jackson of Atlanta, I'm filming for you guys now. But um, I have like some videos to shoot, some brand deals to shoot, and all that. But typically in the mornings, I just put on some comfortable. Sometimes I do get dressed for like the day. Like I go on and put on like a whole fit or whatnot. But today, that is definitely not what I'm doing this morning, at least. Need to make sure check with my editor real quick and make sure that today's upload is going to be up let's go in there real quick y'all hey sarah is the video on um framio for jalen yes okay yes. oh it's on framio it's on framio okay cool um so yeah guys i wanted to check and make sure that was on Framio, if you guys are fellow YouTubers, we use this platform called Framio and it pretty much allows us to like watch the videos our um, editor edits. And then in Framio, we can like put any revisions. So whatever we want changed, we can just pop it in that system and it'll like and put the notes like, hey, we want the subscribe button, pop it right here. And then it'll do that, y'all. I like this hairstyle, y'all, but I promise you, maybe it's just me. I feel like it makes my head big, look big. Like, of course, I, I naturally have a big forehead, but like, do it add an emphasis or something? I know it's still giving and it's still cute because y'all been in the comments like, line of hair, line of hair, line of hair, line of hair, line of hair. Line of hair. But like, I feel like it makes my head big. I don't know. But anyway, I'm getting ready to make my coffee. I usually do, um, oh, this looks different. It has like some bread on it. Y'all, I usually do, what is it called? French vanilla. But they out of French vanilla. So this is the original. But why does it have bread right here? Like, what do they mean by original with bread? I did also run out of my, like, coffee pot things. And so I did get more of those. The breakfast blend light. Love it. Um, So I'm getting ready to make my coffee. I think I'm going to slice me an apple. Um, Because I had an apple the other day, y'all. And it was so good. And I was like... Yeah, I need this type of energy, type of, um, like, energy booster. Like, I had this, y'all, and I'm not being dramatic for real, for real. I literally had an apple, and I felt like I was dehydrated, and the apple just made me just feel energized. I don't know, I might do the coffee first, then kind of work a little bit, then come back for the apple, because I don't want to put too much on my stomach with the coffee. I don't know, we'll figure it out, but I'm going to make the coffee now. been doing that I feel like has made a world of difference is I go ahead and put my creamer and my sugar in my coffee before I do my coffee and I feel like that's made a world of difference because like the coffee stays super hot opposed to like you make your hot coffee and then you put this cold creamer in and then it makes your coffee like lukewarm or whatnot. It's hard for me to understand So many things have taken place Before this love affair began But if you fail You're like a fail Confusion can't give way to doubt For there are times when I fall short What I say What I say I'm all about all right, y'all. So one thing I do in the mornings is I go ahead and make Bay's coffee. Ain't that so sweet? I go ahead and make his coffee too. So that's why I just went, y'all, just now to um, take him his coffee. It is nine o'clock. I am very much late for work. Oh, uh, I am supposed to be downstairs in my glam room. Honestly, around seven a.m. 6.30, those are the times I'm supposed to be down there. Y'all see how late I am today? Do better, MJ, do better. Y'all, I am in love with my glam room slash office. It turned out so freaking amazing. Like, can we just talk about it? Like, I am genuinely in love with the results. Uh, Y'all hear Shadow? I hear my cat in the background. Um, if anybody calling me a Shadow, I don't even want none, y'all. Um, if you don't know, I have a cat and his name is Shadow. And y'all, he is like a child. Phew, all right, time to sit at the big desk. 
I'm a big boss. I gotta do big boss things. <laughs> I'm serious though. So let me get to work. Alright guys, so um my one of my twin sons, they're starting school, so they I need to move my desk because this is where they work at. Uh this well, this is the room that he does his schooling in. Um his therapist will be here like in seven minutes. So I'm getting ready to move my desk. Um so I can pretty much set up their area, get the toys and stuff for them and all that. So let's do it. y'all so y'all saw i like rearranged my office that's why um i told y'all earlier i like to get up and be in my office like 6 37 because that means like i have adequate amount of time to really work and get what i need to get done before they use my office um but it's all good i'm gonna end up either going into justin's office or going on the couch and finish working or at the kitchen table somewhere i'm gonna finish working at it is what it is. The life of also being a mother and busy businesswoman, content creator, just life be life. And so let me finish getting what they need so they can get started because it's almost 10. The day is rolling. It's like 10 o'clock in like five minutes. So I'm going to go get all the things that he needs to start his session and then I'm going to get back to work. All right, y'all. So I am literally in my living room right now. Um, working and I am using this whiteboard. I love this whiteboard, y'all. I really want to get one that is like on a stand that I can roll, but I am going to um, finish with emails. I have a few more that I need to check and kind of jot down some things from these emails. And then I'm going to pretty much write out my to-do list for today, what I'm focusing on and kind of for the rest of the week like it all depends on how much i can write on here and then i'm going to get into it i know i have some brand deals i have to record today and so i'm probably going to try to knock those out this morning like you guys saw yesterday was predominantly like a shooting day so i did a lot of shooting and then today is more like administration like i'm getting work done it'd be a lot like i'm not saying that it's like bad but it'd be a lot people be thinking like influences it's like dropping fire pics and stuff all the time and like living taking the camera with you to Cancun and Tulum and stuff. And yes, that's a part of the job, but there's work to be done. There's definitely work to be done. I know I just been drinking on the low, mobbing on the low, fucking on the low, smoking on the low. I still been plotting on the low, scheming on the low. Stay from perfect like everyone I know. I just been drinking on the low, mobbing on the low, fucking on the low, smoking on the low. All right, y'all. So, um, I am literally, I changed shirts because I had like a meeting in about three minutes. So I was actually getting ready to eat me some lunch, but I just realized that it's three minutes of my meeting, so I'm probably not gonna eat this till later. But I am gonna show you guys what I got. Um, so I ended up getting something from Publix. It's kind of like a sub, but it is turkey, provolone cheese, bacon, what else? Like mayonnaise, mayo, kind of type of mix like that. Got that from Publix. I, this is a half, but it also comes with another like whole or whatnot. So um, I was going to eat my lunch, but literally by the time I got to the table, y'all, I looked at the clock and my meeting starts in three minutes. So I really just need to hop on my meeting and get ready for that. I have two back-to-back -back meetings. I have a 2.15 to a 2.30. Then I have a 2.30 to 2.50 meeting. Um, and so then I should be able to eat my lunch after that. But this is literally my first meal, y'all. I had coffee. I was supposed to come back and chop that apple. Never did it. I'm getting ready to hop on those meetings. Then I'll swing back, eat my lunch, and then finish getting into the day. So let's do it. So y'all, I just got off call one and I'm getting ready to jump on call two now. 
All right, guys, so I'm getting ready to hop on um, calls too, but they're not on here yet. Our time, call time is like 2.30. It's 2.33, they're not on here, so I'm not gonna give them that long because y'all, I'm very straight to the point and direct, like my time is money for real, for real. And I ain't trying to be funny. So like, they need to come on on here. So I give everybody like five to seven minutes grace period. See your girl gone. Um, so I'm eating my sandwich. It's so good. I'm pairing it with these flaming Hot Barbecue uh chips so i'm waiting on this car to start y'all it's now 2 33 so we shall see all right y'all so today i've been busy i'm as you guys saw i had my two meetings and then after that I had to do some stuff for social media um, I finished working. Oh, shot two YouTube videos. Your girl been working, okay? Um, but my fashion over order just came in the mail, so I wanted to show you guys what I got. These items I got, I'm pairing it with like this real, real cute look. The look actually didn't come in the mail, or did it? I think it came, y'all. Oh yeah, it is here. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna show you guys like, oh, what I got. It's so cute. Um, this look isn't for like a special occasion or anything. It's just like, you know, a look. First things first, we got a pair of shades because, listen, is it really me if I don't order me a new pair of shades? Listen, Fashion Nova, y'all, needs to sponsor me because I be, listen, throwing a fit in their fit, okay? But here's the shades. They are super cute. I'm in love. A beautiful teal color. Let me try them on. Mm, mm, mm. See how they look. Let's rate them. I think, ooh, they giving. Yes, ma'am. I like these a lot. Then I got these gold pair of earrings. If I could be honest with y'all, I don't be ordering jewelry from Fashion Nova. Not for a particular reason, but I just don't. But I said, let me go ahead and give their jewelry a try. Comment down below if y'all be wearing Fashion Nova jewelry. They were definitely cute on the site. Ooh, yeah, they cute in real life too. <laughs> Not real life, but y'all know what I mean. Super cute, I love these. They're like some chunky gold um, earrings. Gonna go perfect with my look. Then they had this 20 piece ring set, y'all. Here's some gold rings, here they are. And it's a 20 piece set, so, and I love how like nice and gold they look. Super, super cute. Then I got this purse. I haven't seen this purse like a whole bunch of places, but um, I never had got me one, so I was like, I don't have any stop playing. Here it is. Ain't she cute? Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to freaking wear this. Look, look at this, y'all. It's a ball. Look. I'm in love. Oh my gosh. I can already see. Do y'all see what's going on here? Do y'all see? We got the gold rings, the gold bag, the gold, like, ooh. Look like I need to go courtside. Like, I need to go to a courtside basketball game with this basketball, like, purse. Mm. So this is the look here, y'all. It's a two-piece. Oh, this is see-through. So that should be, hmm. All right, so here is like the top. Boom. I actually got the perfect bra that I ordered from Adorme that's really gonna set this off. But here's the top. Bottom. It's like a skirt. All right, I'm probably gonna need this hem because y'all know your girl is short. And now that I'm looking at this, Baby, this thing gonna be up to my boobs. <laughs> so I'm definitely gonna have to get this altered. And it's like body con, so it fits the body real nice. And once I get it cropped, it'll look better. It ain't supposed to look, y'all, like a grandma all the way to the flow skirt. It's supposed to be like a uh, body con, and it's really supposed to like stop, like kind of like right there and like kind of hug the ankles. So I'm gonna definitely have to get this altered. Um, so that it can fit exactly how I want it to fit. So my baby behind this look, I was like, I had brown, I picked the brown look, and then I was like, okay, definitely gotta do gold accessories, like, duh. And then I was like, but this is so much brown, I wanted to pop, so I did the green shades. Because it wouldn't be me if I didn't have color. Don't know what color my hair is gonna be for this. Um, definitely not doing black hair. I'm gonna be putting this up actually really soon, y'all. Um, but I don't know what kind of hair I wanna do. Comment down below if y'all have any hair color suggestions. I might do something new, might do something different. What about like a pink bob, like a short pink bob? Mm, I don't know. We'll figure out. 
And then I got this bag to go with it. So I'm excited for this look. It's gonna be definitely cute. Of course, I do got some other stuff, y'all. I got like some holiday um, onesies and pajamas. I got a whole bunch of holiday stuff. That's the Nova haul. I'll see the whole fit. Hold on. Can we get into the little holiday pajamas or something? What? Ow, they are so cute. Um, so anyway, y'all, today is December the 21st. Um, and I'm up this morning. It's not really morning time anymore. It's like 12, so it's definitely noon. I've been probably up since seven something. Um, or before seven something, something like that. But anywho, I had my coffee this morning. Y'all already know what I do. I do like that almost every morning except when i'm not working so whatever day i don't be working saturday sunday if i'm working on those days i'm gonna have coffee but if i'm not working on saturday and sunday then i'm not gonna have coffee coming down some also like more natural ways to get your energy boosted because i do drink a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot, a lot of coffee i don't know how i feel about that mm, i mean i don't really feel no way for it for real um because it is what it is i love coffee even if i don't need an energy booster i love coffee but i try to just limit it to when i need energy boosting only um i'm getting ready to make me some breakfast i'm really just gonna have an apple this morning so i'm getting ready to get that out of the fridge then i have a few things i need to do i need to run some errands i really need to go to target y'all um to pick up some last minute like holiday stuff like this is christmas is four days away Christmas is four days away. Why am I still picking up hot? Like, mind me, if you ain't got it yet, don't even give it at this point. Because what's the point? But I'm still going to Target to pick up some holiday stuff. So, and I got a few other little errands to need to run. So, let me chop this apple up, eat me some breakfast, and get into the day. Where'd you go? Hey y'all, welcome back. It's a new day. Um, I'm literally getting ready to make breakfast for the family. Getting ready to do that now. I um, got a full day ahead of me. Today is December the oh, where's my clock? It's either the 21st or the 22nd. I know that's bad, y'all. But it's one of these one of those days. Um, and I got like a full day, so I wanted to take you guys with me. I'm starting off with cooking some breakfast for the fam. Eggs, bacon, pancakes, and a few other things. Got my Christmas PJs on. This is another cute set. Y'all let's see it while I'm cooking exactly what it is, but it's real cute and cozy. Got some packages in the mail. I'm gonna do some more um unboxings and stuff but it's gonna be a good day so let's get into it All right, babes, um, it is later in the day, but I promised you guys that I was gonna show you guys what I got from Adore Me. So um, I wanted to show you guys what I got. I got so much stuff. Um, I'm always ordering with them, y'all. I really just love um, one their robes. This robe is from them. I really, ooh, dang. <laughs> I really love this robe. This is from them. 
The quality is really nice. This is not sponsored, but I really just love the quality of their items. But like I got this time like some more sets, like uh, joggers from when I'm like running out and different things like that. So let's get into uh, this whole, this ain't a crown haul because your girl ain't gonna be trying on all these pieces. But I'm gonna show you what it is. So I guess an unboxing per se. Let's get into it. It's gonna be fun. So guys, y'all know we are in the beauty room. We're in the beauty room. Things are rearranged because I did tell you guys that my son Justin, he is doing therapy in my beauty room right now. And so I have to kind of like move things out the way for them, which I definitely don't mind. Like, if you know me, you know I didn't think my kids. Listen, what you want me to move? I don't mind one bit. You hear me? This right here I got is a black bra. Um, it can be strapless. I think I'm gonna turn around so you guys can see better, but it can be strapless or it has straps, but I really love it. The quality is super, super nice. Got this in a size 38 double D. Um, why did I do that? I think this is the sister size or something to the normal size that I wear, because I usually don't get a 38. Um, I usually get a 36, but uh, they were out of, so out of stock of my normal bra size, and so I had to go get the sister size. If you ever shop somewhere, y'all, and they don't have your normal size, always like search the web for like the sister size, and then you'll be able to get, you know, whatever it is that you want. It'll just be the sister size of the bra. I hope that makes sense. I learned that years back when um, I went to Victoria's Secret, and literally, I was the bra fit exactly how I wanted it to, and everything. It was my sister size that I had to get. I got this bra right here. I like the lace on it. What I think I'm going to do is probably wear this bra with like an outfit. I think that'll be really cute. So maybe I could wear like a blazer or something. I'll have to kind of finesse it because I don't never like fully show my stomach. I'll be having it covered to a certain part um, just because like the extra skin and be sagging and everything just from all the pregnancies that I've had. And so, until I get my tummy tuck, I am, you know, I just kind of cover it up. I don't be ashamed of or anything, but you know, it kind of just be like the skin be kind of droopy. So I'll just wear high waisted stuff to kind of camouflage it. And so I think I want to wear this bra like under something and give like that sexy look, but I have to figure out what kind of bottom. So maybe like some high waisted or high waisted skirt, maybe with a split or something. So next I have this. What is this? Adore me. I think this is a robe. Oh, no, 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 no. This is a gown. It's really cute and sexy. It's just pink. It has a little bit of lace to it. I thought it was really cute. Here it is. And it's really cute. You know, give your body a little shape. And, you know, I love stuff like this where I'm just like on my bed working on my computer, but I want to be sexy, but I don't want to. I don't know. I try all the time not to be sexy, but I guess what I'm saying is I love to feel sexy. I love to feel good. And sometimes I just want to put on a pair of leggings. Like right now I got on a pair of leggings. But I feel like when I add little things like put on like a cute little gown or something with my like slippers and a necklace, even though I'm chilling, I just feel really good. And I really believe when you look good, you feel good. So I always like add little sets and stuff like this to my library. This, y'all, I thought this was so freaking cute. Oh, that is cute. I love that it's not just a standard bra. Like it goes, like it extends, which I thought is really cute. I love the color. One thing about me is I love color. I, as y'all already know, I love color because of the different hairdos that I do and stuff like that. But I just love colorful looks and stuff on my skin overall. I just like vibrant colors. I really don't like dark colors that much. Like only dark color I for real for real do is black, okay? Other than that, I don't wanna do like burgundy and stuff. I'll do it from time to time. Like if that's what the look needs, but I really prefer to be in something bright, bold, like a confident color, no matter what the season is. So y'all, this is all the stuff I got from Adore Me, this stuff here. Now, not this, like not this um, mustard and brown, that's like me and Bae's stuff, but all of this stuff in like the poly bags I've got from Adore Me. And then here's some more stuff I had got from Adore Me. So it's a whole lot of stuff, you hear me? But I kind of just wanted to go over like my favorite pieces per se. For example, like these two pieces, well, these three pieces, I'm gonna show y'all these. 
because they're really, really cute. This one right here is really cute. It is a corset. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I thought this was like much brighter. It almost looks burgundy. Like after I literally just said, I'm like wearing burgundy. Here goes a burgundy piece. But I thought this was lighter. I don't know. Maybe I read that wrong or my eyes was playing little tricks on me because I will say they are definitely very true to like their colors. But this is it. It's really cute. I like that. And then it actually comes with some underwear, which is here. So I think this is gonna be a really nice set. I'll probably model this set in one of my next photo shoots or whatnot. I'll just have to find like something to go with it. Y'all, why does it seem like I literally just said I don't like dark colors and literally these corsets are dark. Super cute. It gives like that New Year's feel. So I think I'm probably gonna shoot this one first with my photographer. These are the underwear. It's nothing but a G-string. You hear me? Nothing but a G-string. I have these pajamas, which are also really, really cute. I'm probably gonna wear this in a shoot as well because I love how bright this is. I think it'll be really pretty on my skin. I'm gonna be changing my hair soon. I don't know what color I wanna get, so comment down below what color y'all think I should get. I have literally no clue, but I wanna try something different. I think I want to try something short. It's going to be literally temporary, y'all. Like, I ain't going to keep it long. Like, I don't have intentions to keep it long because I do not like short hair. I don't know what it is. Like, this is for real, for real the shortest I like to go. This. And I think with this the next look I'm going to do, it's going to be, like, really short, like, right here. Can y'all see me with something that short? Like, probably, like, right here, for real, for real. And it's going to be a bright color. I think it's gonna be a different texture, so it's not gonna be like your standard straight. I think I wanna do something that gives like a wet and wavy look. So it should be really, really interested. I'm definitely excited to try it. Me and my hairstylist, we be chopping it up, you know, sharing different thoughts and sharing different looks. She always got something up her sleeve. She want me to do highlights, y'all. Comment down below how y'all think that would look. I think it'd be cute. Um, right now, I'm trying to find like, what is my hairstyle in between color looks? Because I'm always doing color looks for my campaigns, my photo shoots, um, and everything like that. And so I'm like, okay, when I'm not wearing bright colors, what do I want to be my go-to? Like, okay, I just finished shooting a big campaign for this brand or for whatever. And like, I'm done with the red or whatever color. So what color do I want to go back to? And you kind of know this as my signature kind of in between color looks. Let me show y'all two more things. Because this right here is the corset I thought, like one when I was like, oh, I thought that was like a lighter red, made my eyes playing tricks on me. My eyes were playing tricks on me because that's not even the, the one I thought it was. Here's the thong. And then here is the corset that I thought was fly. I love how bright it is. It's cute. To me, it's still very much giving um, New Year type of vibes. Honestly, it's kind of giving holiday for real. real. I could have worn it like this season. But I love this. It's cute. I don't think I'm going to wear the thong like by itself with this. I think I'm going to actually take this and add this to like an outfit. Maybe some kind of cool pants. Um, I see this has white. So maybe I can maybe bring out like some, mm, not white pants just yet. But I have to figure out what colors I want to play with with these pants. But I want to make it like an outfit. Really cute with some popping different color heels. It, I want it to be really, really fun. So that's that. And then this is the jogger set that I got. This is the hoodie to it. And then the pants are literally right here. The bottom to this is right here. Um, but this is the hoodie. I thought it was super, super cute. I really thought it was cute. It's like a bright red. I love stuff that when I'm busy, I can just throw it on with some shoes, some boots, and just be outdoor. It's so much more stuff, but I just wanted to show you guys a few pieces that I'm loving right now. And those are definitely some, um, or definitely some that are part of that order. So that's the Adore Me Home. Hey, babes. So it's a new day. It's the next day. And... Ooh, your girl's up. I've been working, y'all. Look at my hair. It's like 148, y'all. Oh, I've had so much freaking go on this morning. It's been crazy. From business to personal stuff. Um, if you guys watch our family channel, the Jackie Level and my son, he's starting school and home. He already started. And it has just been like a great, like, it's great overall that he's starting because we've been wanting to do this for I don't know how long but it can be stressful because you know he's transitioning into it and he's having a hard time so 
a lot of well he's not having too much of a hard time but like some days is harder than others put it that way because they're challenging him just like school you know we all have those days where we're just like over it and that was him today and so i literally had to pull him out of class help him just transition and all of that and i had to do that like three or four times today um which is definitely more than normal and so it kind of just threw the flow of everything of my day kind of like off um definitely not blaming him just it's just like a mom thing you know like when you get up and you set your schedule and you're trying to like be proactive productive and then you know things kind of go left with your kids school i know i'm not the only one and so it just kind of threw things left in my day and then as soon as i finished tackling that i had another situation happen then another situation happened and so it was just like i haven't been able to get back and refocus on what my just on what my thing my goals are today um but that's okay that's okay Y'all know me. I don't like to complain. I always just like to find solutions. So, um, I do have some good news, though. Um, I received a gifting from Caseify. I'm sure you guys have heard of Caseify. They are amazing. This isn't sponsored. Literally, they were like, hey, Mahogany, we love you. We would love to just send you, like, a bunch of cases. And so, I love Caseify's cases. Right now, I have... Y'all can't see my phone because I'm recording on it. But uh, right now, I have, like, a clear case on. And so... Um, I'm excited to try like their new cases. They literally sent me like a slew of cases y'all. So I'm going to show you guys those really excited about that. Then I also downloaded me a new digital planner from SD y'all that I'll put in the link of the description box. Um, I downloaded this for 2023. And so I'm excited about that because my 2022 one is obviously <laughs> coming to an end. And so I'm really, really excited to show you guys that. So I'm gonna show you guys those two things and then I'm probably gonna wrap up this vlog. Ooh, because your girl is just trying to realign herself, realign her day, but I ain't gonna let me let it stop me. Just like I would tell y'all, don't let it stop you. Don't let it stop. Don't let it stop you. I ain't gonna let it stop me. So let me head outside. The package is still outside. I'm gonna go bring it in. Um, so you guys can see what I got from Case of I. Super excited about it. Alright, guys. Oh, excuse my little outfit on today. What am I even wearing, y'all? I got on this shirt that i had since high school because i used to play tennis i was the number one seed mm -hmm. the packaging looks like so fun okay here it is Aww. i'm gonna come closer so you guys can see but here is the packaging i think that is so adorable y'all what's that thing so cute open it up all right y'all so i got this one right here oh so oh these turn out so good here is the first ones i got i got this one that says phone eats first because baby we noticed to be true as a creator because my phone gonna eat first like when i'm out in public and stuff phone is eating first phone is getting pictures of the food before i can even eat um i thought this one was super fun this kid i thought that was super cool and cute um I got Justin one. He's very, you know, straight to the point. It's just Justin. That's three right there. And I got three more. This one right here. It says, um, well, it actually doesn't say anything, but it's like this snake design. I thought that was so cute. I was like, I need that. Then I got this one right here. I'm sure you guys have seen that one. It's been like a trend. Um, that one's cute like the phone battery pack thing and then i got this one right here it's like pink on the side or black so got some really cute ones y'all comment down below what your favorite one is out of all of the six that i got well out of the five because one is just i mean unless y'all like that one you can like that one like in your own name i suppose um but let me show y'all this planner because i know y'all love staying up to date with like the planners that i get and stuff so let me show you that and i'm going to make sure that i link it in the description box so that you guys can pop yours all right, y'all, so I'm at the table in my kitchen. And I wanted to show you guys the planner that I have. So just to answer a few of those questions that you always ask, I have the, I'm trying to find it on here, y'all. So I have the iPad Pro 12.9 inch, that's the biggest one, fifth generation. So I have literally the latest one, the biggest size. So I get all of my calendars from SD because when I be searching like calendars, SD is always the website that comes up. So 
all of my calendars are imported into my good it's called good notes good notes app so they're compatible with good nap good notes if you use good notes but it is some other ways you can import the calendar in if you use different apps all right y'all so this is my new calendar i did not go with the same vendor that i had last time i went with a different one it's probably gonna be best for me to kind of just show you guys more without like me being right here but um yeah because i don't think y'all gonna be able to see it but i definitely definitely love it so far but let's go ahead and get into the nitty gritty all right y'all so this is the planner i really love it this is the index page it's so much in this planner y'all it's crazy i don't even know if i'm gonna be able to go over everything all right y'all so hopefully this is better i put y'all on my stand because i feel like i was moving around and stuff and i didn't want y'all going through that i want y'all to get a really good tutorial all right so right here we was at yearly 2023 calendar okay we've seen that next i'm going to click goals and so this is where they let you put your 2023 um goals like just a general scope of your goal and then like how do you plan to achieve these goals and um like what's your reward when you do achieve that goal so that is super super detailed there then you can hit right here and go back to goals when i say this thing is so thorough y'all it's crazy i know i'm not even gonna use all these features then right here you got year at a glance and that's just like your year like you know six months and then the day is going down like that so i really like that then you have like monthly right here so january for each month you have like the monthly calendar you can go back to the index then you have like a plan so your month, how you plan to do stuff, your personal, professional, other important dates and deadlines, to-do lists for the month, top priorities, main focus for this month. Y'all, when I say this thing is so thorough, it is crazy, okay? Go back to the index again. And then you have like your month review. So it lets you at the end of the month review your month, like, and then rate it one to 10. So much stuff y'all know i ain't gonna use all these features it has finance monthly budget income utilities financial to-do list um impulsive like shopping transportation food like a whole budget right there then we go back to index again and then you can hit trackers and then this is more so for like habits goals why is this important it lets you um you know scratch out different like dates and stuff like super super thorough again your hydration tracker it has that there um really beneficial it's so many features y'all i don't even think i'm gonna be able to take y'all through everything then it also within this one planner has so many different notebooks so like you could have notebooks inside the dang on planner y'all make it make sense literally has 10 different notebooks then it has 12 different project tabs where you can talk about different projects so like birthday parties whatever your projects are launching a product all right then on these templates on the side <laughs> i ain't gonna be able to go through all of them y'all it's so much that's what i mean this planner has so much stuff but i'm gonna just highlight the ones that i'm probably gonna use highlight a few of the ones i'm gonna use we have monthly sleep i doubt i'll use that for real for real but it lets you track your sleep hydration tracker is an important one to me like definitely got to use that i'm probably gonna start using that today for real because i need to make sure that i'm hydrating and that's on period okay and then after each month you just you know um wipe it off or whatever unless you put your month right there um go back to the index it has a symptoms tracker where you can track like any symptoms that's erratic irrational or you know you're trying to make sure that ain't nothing going on or whatever and you just want to you know just check everything um you have a habit tracker mood tracker period tracker that's definitely what i'm going to use to make sure my periods are coming and consistent baby all right that uh vitamins and medication tracker it's just so much tractors under that was under wellness productivity fitness nutrition finance others so guys definitely recommend you check out this planner so y'all that is the planner comment down below if you liked it i think the planner was only like i don't think it was more than 15 dollars. i don't even think it was that much y'all. i think it was like probably eight dollars SD prices be crazy. I'm like, how are y'all even making profit off of all this stuff y'all doing? But I, I did say they had like probably 10,000 sales. So I mean, 10,000 times what? $8 ain't bad at all, okay? I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I hope you guys just enjoyed going with me throughout the week. Comment down below what you want to see more of in my vlogs. What other kind of content you want me to do. Comment all of that stuff down below because I'm definitely open to it. Um, 
your girl also gonna be getting her nose repierced in a vlog here soon because baby like i miss my nose piercing so much i'm gonna be going to the hair salon changing my hair up because i need to do that um so it's gonna be so much going on especially for this new year i already created a vision board in one of my old videos you guys know that um but i think i want to create another vision board so if you guys want to see me do that comment down below um but i can kind of show you my vision board now wait one sec i created mine um a few months ago and i really really love it it's so much that i have on here um that i literally already have a start started accomplishing because this was more so like 2020 and beyond 2022 and beyond i'm probably going to update it a bit but a lot of stuff i had already like started being true on true to and working on and so definitely had body goals on here because baby y'all know it's just gonna be getting a mind makeover can't wait um after that i have um travel goals which i definitely started traveling more after making this glam room goals i love that big boss goals as far as like my business my warehouse home goals um car goals fashion goals family life goals reading more goals strong stronger prayer life goals then I also like took right here and I put me some encouraging words. So like every day I'm closer to my goals, watch it happen for you. Just different little encouraging things on my dream vision board that helps me stay focused. Um, stand by in the Bible where it says, write the vision and make it plain. And literally when you write it and you make it plain and you see it, it's so easier for you to um, just get up every day and work towards it. Like you know, regardless of the type of day you're having, just continue to get towards them goals. Um, and the Bible says also without a vision, the people perish. And literally when you don't have a vision for your life, it e makes you easier to be a target for depression, a target for, you know, just low self-esteem and just different things because you are not necessarily improving yourself because you have no vision for what you want yourself to be or what you want your life to be. I'm not saying you have to have it all figured out, but just knowing like, okay, the woman I wanna be, she looks like this, she has this, she talks like this, she walks like that. Having that stuff, like having a vision, that's a vision for what you see yourself as, that lets you get up every single day to work towards that. So if you guys want me to do another vision more video, I definitely don't mind, I can do that. Um, but I'm excited for this new year. I'm excited for what's to come. I love the holidays. Um, and I'm just excited about life in general. So guys, I love you so, so much. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Make sure, make sure you hit that subscribe button, turn on that post notification bell, and you connect with me on literally all social media platforms. Guys, I'm everywhere. Do you hear me? I'm everywhere. Type in my name, Mahogany Jackson. Or a lot of times you can just type in at mahogany j underscore and I'll come up. But literally, y'all, or if those don't work, to type in mahogany as well. But nine times out of ten, if you just type in mahogany Jackson, you won't find me because ain't a lot of mahogany Jacksons out here. Okay. But um, I'm excited for what's to come. Stay connected with me. I love you guys so, so much. And I can't wait to see you in the next vlog. Bye.